Welcome to this tutorial. In previous tutorial, we have created the custom environment and we have registered the same to the Azure Machine Learning Workspace. Now in this tutorial, we will create the training script. Let us begin. The training script that we are creating will handle the pre-processing of the data, splitting it into train and test sets, consuming the data to train a tree-based model and returning the output model. In the training script, we will use the ML flow to log the parameters and matrices during the job. First, we will create the source folder. I'll paste the code. First, we are importing OS. This is for the operating system. Then we are defining this variable dot forward slash src. We are creating this folder in the root directory. And here we are creating this directory. Execute. Let us check the directory, refresh here and the src directory is created successfully. Now we will write the training script in that folder, src, I will paste the code here. Let us understand this code. We are writing this file, write file, main.py, this will be the file name. First, we are importing the required classes. Here, we are importing OS, arc parse, pandas, mlflow, mlflow.sklearn, gradient boosting classifier, classification report, and train test split. Then, we are defining a function here, main. And here we are passing the input and output arguments. Then start logging mlflow.start run. After that, we are enabling auto logging mlflow.sklearn.auto log. After that, we are preparing the data. First, we are defining the data frame credit underscore df. Then we are logging these two matrices number of samples and number of features. Then we are splitting the data into train and test set. After that, we are defining y train, x train, y test, and x test. Then we are creating an object of this class, gradient boosting classifier. This is the class, and this is the object. Here we are specifying number of estimators and learning rate. Here we are training the machine learning model, and here we are getting the predictions. And after that, we are printing the classification report. Then we are registering the model to the workspace. mlflow.sklearn, the method log model. Here we are specifying the sk model, the class that we defined here, clf. Registered model name. And the path of the artifact. After that, we are saving the model mlflow.sklearn.save model. Here we are again specifying the object clf and path. Let us execute this cell. Refresh. And the file is created successfully main.py. So in this tutorial, we have created the training script. In the next tutorial, we will configure the command and we will submit the job.